Hi, I'm Real Generic Demon, and this is Donkey Kong on the Amstrad CPC. Now, I've been told, and I can tell you it's true, um, this is one of the best conversions of the game for an 8-bit generation, um, and, and without a doubt, it's stunning. However, that loading screen is awful. I can't believe how bad that is. That, if I'd saw that loading up, I'd be like, oh my God, what's this going to be like? Is this going to be another uh, a, a port from some other, some other thing? But no, um, the Amstrad CPC version, as you can see, straight from the beginning, it's just stunning it looks great this is a this is a proper donkey kong clone this really is one of the best i've ever seen it's got the right music it's got the right sounds it's got the right look um mario looks correct um seriously it does prove as well though at a small point and i've said to me previously about the, the amstrad cpc first off it's it was it was it wasn't exactly utilized well in in in, in the 80s when it first came out but it is a stunning machine with 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 so many capabilities just look at the look at the detail that's going on here that this is this is almost this is almost as good as you can get without being the arcade version Let's see if I can get up here. I'm not very good at this game, so I will be concentrating a little bit on it. Um, Donkey Kong. Um, the arrival of Mario um, and Donkey Kong themselves from Nintendo. No, I don't think it's their first routing, though. There was definitely Mario Brothers. I'm sure there was. Now, I have played this on the Spectrum. If you want to have a little look at it, go have a look. It's not actually bad on the Spectrum, I have to admit, but it's not like this. I mean, this just looks brilliant, doesn't it? Come on. Get to her. There we go, I've rescued her. Now he takes off with her again. To the next level. I'm not, as I say, I'm not a big... I'm not a Donkey Kong player. I'm not... I don't know the ins and outs of it. I... I I always, it's like a lot of things. I like these games. I like I like to play them, but I'm I'm not very good at them. Um, so I think I need to get up here. Bonus points. All right. There's a ladder. Need to go up that ladder. Come on, let me get up. What have I got to do to get the ladder to go up? Do I have to wait? Is it just a time-based thing? Or do I go down here? Or maybe go down here. There's that fire there, though. Oh! Fell too far. Oh, it's brilliant, though, isn't it? I mean, look at that for graphics. I mean, that's absolutely stunning. It's not... It is not... Um, it is not a bad game whatsoever. In fact, it looks brilliant. And it plays really well as well. I mean, the... the, the it, uh, as I say, Donkey Kong for me is quite a hard game anyway, but but this is this is this is brilliant. Well, I'm going to go for it again, definitely, because we need to see more of these graphics and see the sounds and see what's going on. This is this is this is how it should have been on every every, every version. What was the C C64 version like or the Commodore version like? I don't think I've actually ever seen the Commodore version, but definitely seen the the Spectrum version. Okay, up we go. Okay. Okay, up we go. Yes, first time. Brilliant. I can't believe I made it all the way up. Excellent. Well, I'm pleased with that. I don't think I've ever finished le the, this this stage. I, 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 the thing about I'm so weird. I've played lots of games over and over again. I've got a lot of games that I, I really like. Um, this this fits into that category of games that I like. Um, but ah, ah, down there. Um, one of those games that I like, but I'm never very good at. Um, in fact, I've done so much better on the Amstrad version than I've ever done on any previous version. I'm quite impressed with myself, to be honest. Come on. There, I'm up. I think I've done it. Next level, wow. This is the best I've ever done. 
and you'll get to see more and more of these absolutely stunning, gorgeous palette, beautiful looking levels. Right, so I've got to make my way back up here. So where do I have to go here to get up? So do I get on that? Yep. Oh, he's throwing... Oh, he's not throwing things. He's, there's things bouncing off the edge there. Right, so do I... I think I've made a mistake here, because I, I think I could probably have... Oh, fell off. Oh, I didn't fall off. I walked off, but... 75 metres. How high can you get? Probably not much further than this. I can, t I can, I can feel, I can feel it being quite tough. Ah! Why did I do that? Oh! I thought I could jump on the ladder. I was, I, I was in, I was in Chucky Egg mode where you can jump onto ladders while they're moving. Um. Okay. Oh, and bashed into the great girder. And we've gone flying off the edge. Oh, game over. Oh, wow. Game over. Um, I, I, you know what? I, although I can, I could play on for a bit. I'm not. I'm going to leave it there because that. I'm going to leave it. I'm going to leave it on what, what I would call win. You know, level three for me is a win. Um, but but what a stunning game. What a fantastic game. What how good does that look on the Amstrad? Um, I. I I, c I can't recommend that enough. It's so worth playing. 1986 that came out for the for the for the, for the Amstrad. Really, really good. Great game. Anyway, I've been your host, Real Genetic Demon. Thank you for watching. Please feel free to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you in my next video. Bye bye now.